Hi guys, and welcome to today's video. Tamago wants to join in, hold on. Moving forward, I'm gonna do a lot of what I eat in Honolulu videos. Pretty much gonna take you guys around and show you guys where I eat on a regular basis. And I'm always trying new food, so I'm also gonna be trying places I've never been before. So if you guys wanna see more videos like this, hit subscribe, I'm gonna make this a series. And let's get started. of seafood. We have crawfish, clams, and we ordered an extra pound of shrimp. First, let's try the mozzarella sticks. It's so fresh and hot, guys. This is amazing. The manager dropped off one more bag, one more pound of crawfish, so we're gonna add this too. This has now turned into a crawfish mukbang. Look at all that crawfish. Look at that, guys. Okay, then we're gonna pull out the meat. That's all the meat that's left from this big piece. Wow, it's so fresh, it's so hot. Everything tastes so good. Hey, where do we get scripts? Where do we get scripts, guys? Oh, thank you so much! Oh, hi! Nice meeting you. Oh, hi! Dude, we're like rushing because we only have like 20 minutes to use these scripts or else like it's done because this is the last day of the carnival. Oh, yeah, we are! Nice meeting you. Alright, guys, we are now gonna get some burgers. Hi! What? Oh, we just got here, so we're like rushing. <laughs> yeah. Nice meeting you! I lost Sandy. I literally can't right now. Sandy got two Terry burgers with cheese and I got mine without cheese. 12 plus 3 plus 1, 15, 16. Okay, I have 16. Do you have like room in your bag? Or should I get the tote bag? Oh, thank you! Nice meeting you! <laughs> Everyone's so nice here. Alright, here you go. Thank you! Have a great night, guys. <laughs> I'm gonna try the malasadas one more time and we'll see if the line is still there. We made it to the express line. Oh! Thank you. Hi, can I get three please? Yeah. Okay, thank you so much. We have 12 more scripts and the noodles is closed so we're gonna figure out what else is open. Can we go get more malasadas? Like what do we do? How are you? Oh yeah, yeah. What are you doing? Nice to meet you. <laughs> yeah, of course. Thanks, we need you guys. Bye. Bye. Hi to the vlog. Hi. Oh, what? Oh, what? YouTube channel? Oh, I have YouTube now. Yeah. What is it for? It's for YouTube. What is it called? Oh, oh it's my name, Rich Hayashi. I have four more. Oh, hi. Nice to meet you. Oh, throws, yeah, come visit. Never see you guys. Oh, really? Nice meeting. What's your name? Rylan. Nice meeting, Rylan. Bye. Oh, it's okay. Oh, thank you. Oh, the rings. Should we do the rings? Let's do the rings. Be sure. Thank you. This is the last game of the night, guys. Oh, no. Okay. That's it. We're done. We got rejected like at least 10 billion times tonight. Listen. Oh, hi. Yeah, of course. Yeah, I yeah. am. Do you want to be in it? I'm so happy. Thank you. Oh, hi. Hi, guys. Security, three, two, one. That's the other way. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Nice meeting you. Secured the bag. We got so much stuff. I'm going to show you guys a haul when we get back. Look how good this looks. It smells 
It smells amazing. Okay, I was in the middle of eating Korean spicy noodles, so I have my Korean spicy noodles, and then I also always eat it with like a bunch of green onions, so I always buy a side of green onions. I also got mala sadas. I put them in the air fryer, so they're kind of burnt. Um, they're low-key black, but it's gonna taste the same. And then I got three Portuguese bean soups. This is like a soup with Portuguese sausages, carrots, macaroni. The line was pretty long for the Portuguese bean soup and the masala, but it moved really fast as you saw last night. And we met so many people, it was so much fun. You guys are so sweet. I'm gonna give this a 10 out of 10. This is amazing. For my Korean spicy noodles, I added like enoki mushrooms and then some mozzarella cheese sticks. So this actually, for whatever reason, matches the Portuguese bean soup really well. For dessert, I got the masala. These were only 50 cents each, and that masala line was so long, but let's try it. It's more doughy. Granted, I should have ate this like right away when, right when I got it last night, but the flavor is really good. I think this is the cheapest masala on the island. It kind of reminds me more of an andagi. I give this a 9 out of 10. I love going to Pinot Carnival. I go to Pinot Carnival every year. These two are worth going for. Just get, just go for these two. They're so good. Excuse me? Are you guys so yeah. Oh yes, hi! Oh, Can you take a oh yeah, of course! <laughs> Thank you guys! Bye guys, nice meeting you! <laughs> Alright guys, we got Korean Bingsu today. Guys, we are now at Ala Moana Shopping Center and the owner, Tina, invited uh, me to try all of their drinks. So I'm gonna show you guys what I got. First, we got a mixed fruit bubble tea and this has boba and all of the fruit that they sell. It's like kind of tart from the grapefruit, but not too tart. I give this an eight out of 10. I also got a golden kiwi drink. This one is really like sour and I don't know if I like this one. I give this a like a six out of 10. A peach jasmine tea and this is with lychee jelly. Mm. I give this one an 8 out of 10. I really love the lychee jelly in this one. And I've been craving ube lately, so I got an ube frappuccino with a boba. The ube flavor is not as strong as I'd like, but the boba is really good. I give this a 7 out of 10. Their most popular item is mango here, because they're called mango mango. So I had to get two of the mango mango cocoa sticky rice drinks, and these look so good. I was super excited for this one. This is kind of like a mango sticky rice drink. I've had a few in Bangkok, so I hope that this lives up to it. Mm. Their mango is really good. Well, I mean, they're called Mango Mango for a reason, so I give this a 9.5 out of 10. Anyways, thank you so much, Tina, for inviting me, and I had a great time. Everything was so good. We were at Bo's Kitchen because I wanted, like, dumplings and wonton. I think I'm gonna get one of the soups. They all look so good. So I'm gonna order a brisket wonton noodle soup without the noodles. Brisket noodle soup. Thank you. Brisket wonton noodle soup. All right, let's try it. Beautiful clear broth. It comes with choy sum. The wontons look so good. There's also like a beef brisket. I think altogether this was about $14.50. Overall, I give this place a 7 out of 10. We are at Ululani's. I got a sour apple and lehi mui, and I got lehi powder. This is actually free on top. The lehi powder is really tart. I love I love anything sour and tart for shea ice. Sour apple will always be my favorite. The ice is so soft, guys. This is like, I would say this is similar to Wyola shea ice, but we would only eat this on Maui, but they just opened on Oahu, so we'll be like going to Wyola, to Ulan, to Wyola, and back and forth. Sour apple, 10 out of 10. Lehi mui. 9 out of 10. We got a PR package from Misaki. These are edible crystals. I'm super excited. First time trying crystals. It's sweet love. Ever crystal. One is rose. Orange kyanite. This one's so pretty. This one was a strawberry, cherry, and chocolate flavor. I thought that it'd be more crunchy from what I've seen on TikTok. I'll also include our promo code down below if you guys want to order one of these. They're super cute, they're great gifts, and they're packaged really pretty with the ribbon. Look at their website, they have like different flavors, and just use our promo code. It never expires. Today we're gonna try Namikaze. It's our first time trying it. Hey guys. 
Hello, good morning. Oh, really? Oh, <laughs> nice meeting you. Corner. Yeah. Thank you. We are at Nami Kaz. I'm gonna scan the menu and see what they have. Super spacious in here. There's a sushi bar and then there's also a dining area. We came with no reservations and they're fully booked, but they like made a table area just for us, just so that we could eat here. So thank you so much. I think they're known for this people's choice and that is the ginger fried chicken. And we literally didn't know one order that. So might have to come back. So Sandy got the beer batter auction fish. It's, oh, it's, it's kind of like, like a fish and chips moment. Right, okay, so Rich didn't get to eat it in Vegas, so we're just gonna live. We're yeah, gonna and live. then you also got like a dessert. Or honey, like a... honey wanna shrimp waffle, which sure you maple syrup. For me, I want like a very much Teishoku vibes. A Teishoku is like a Japanese set with like a bunch of different things. Thank you. Thank you. Look at that. Look how thick this is. There's a tartar sauce, but I'm gonna try the ponzu instead. <laughs> that is so good. I give the beer battered fish a 10 out of 10. The salmon is lightly cooked. I prefer my salmon a little bit more like well done, like more broiled. I do think I prefer Sandy's fish more than mine. Now let's try all of the pickled veggies. We have a carrot. I give the salmon teishoku a 6 out of 10. The honey walnut shrimp is so good. It goes really well with the waffles. It's kind of like chicken and waffles, but instead you're doing like shrimp. My first time having shrimp and waffles and it's pretty damn good. I would give the honey walnut shrimp waffles a 6.5 out of 10. This is the fit. I'm just wearing all black, super casual. Head off to dinner. I'm super excited. Um, it should be like a five minute walk. It's super chilly outside. I see them, they're right across the street and I'll be there in just a bit. And it's located right next to Picky Smalls. It's right here, Kamitoku Ramen. Okay, so we have a highball, okay, we have a ramune sochu, and we have a lemonade sochu. And we have deep fried gyoza and cold ginger tofu. And I'm really excited about this one because that's my favorite. Cheers! Cheers. We have a crispy yuzu chicken skin. This looks amazing. And I have my mini shoyu, shoyu light. And Sandy got a shoyu as well. And then we have a sibura ramen as well. Handshake, handshake. Oh, that's so cute. We're gonna take this to my rooftop. We are just having some red wine tonight and just having a chill night in. Cause it is a Tuesday. When my friends wanted to do brunch, I was like, oh, I don't really want to wake up early for brunch. But then when they mentioned sushi, I was all for it. So I told them to come over. We have a platter. There is ahi and salmon. And everyone told me on TikTok that I need to try Sushi Bay. And this is from Sushi Bay in Kapolei. And we have Chulis, Tito, best friend Anissa, and my bestie Zach. We had, I haven't seen in so long, but we're just catching up. I ordered a strawberry lemonade acai refresher, but I'm super excited. Let's dig in. I literally brought my conveyor belt downstairs to the pool because I wanted to show my friends my conveyor belt. We have the conveyor belt. Everything's set to go. I'm making a TikTok. We're having a good time. I got a chicken ramen. This one comes with spinach, fried onions, thin noodles. Can I get the black sugar boba milky shaved ice? Can I get a medium? Uh, four here, please. Thank you. First, First time, time trying couple cookies. cookies. Cheers! Cheers. Mm. <laughs> oh my god, this lady's good. Hi! Hi mm. Mine is just really sweet. I like how mine is really soft. It's like, you can tell it's freshly baked though. 
really like the texture of this mm -hmm. pattern. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's like soft and mushy. I, I like that. All right, guys. Thanks for watching today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you guys live in Hawaii or if you guys are visiting, let me know where you guys want me to try next. I love eating out. And if you want more behind the scenes footage, don't forget to check my TikTok and my Instagram at Rich Hayashi. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye, guys. Yeah, sunny down.